Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. Strictly Come Dancing star Graziano Di Prima has spoken about the alleged kicking incident that resulted in his departure from the BBC show. Last month, the 30-year-old was cut from the dancing competition series after allegations he kicked and hit his former partner Zara McDermott, 27, in the rehearsal room. His rep later admitted Di Prima kicked former Love Island star McDermott and said in a statement that he apologized at the time and knew he had made a mistake. However, in his first interview since his exit from Strictly, Di Prima has claimed his foot brushed McDermott after he kicked the floor in frustration due to the pressure of the show. Recalling the incident, Di Prima told the Daily Mail, I'm not a monster. I'm not an abusive man. Want to be the first to get all the latest news and rumors from the Strictly dance floor? Join our Strictly Come Dancing WhatsApp channel to keep up to date with all the behind-the-scenes gossip about your favorite pros, judges, and celebrities. Simply click on this link, select Join Chat, and you're in. Don't forget to turn on notifications so you can see when we've just dropped the latest spoilers. Keep dancing. The only thing I can think of is the time I kicked the floor in frustration. We'd practiced hour after hour to perfect a routine with lifts. It wasn't easy, but that's the pressure of the show. I wasn't meaning to kick her. I'd never, never do that. My foot brushed her after I kicked the floor. Afterwards I hugged her and said I was sorry. There was no problem. We carried on. I'm not sure if this is it or if it's from when we, as professional dancers, move our partner's leg with our foot. That is what is so difficult for me, not knowing. It comes after sources told The Sun that McDermott danced with a fractured leg for the week leading up to the Halloween performance during the 2023 season. It was claimed she complained of the niggling pain to McDermott, but he was pretty adamant they needed to crack on. Graziano responded, telling The Mirror, BBC physios were present all week, monitoring the situation and were aware of the pain. I received no guidance on the severity of any injuries. And from what I understood, Zara wanted to continue dancing. McDermott previously addressed the incident in an Instagram statement and said there was footage of their rehearsals that was distressing to watch. She also said she feared speaking out publicly because of backlash and victim shaming. Mac Dermott wrote, So much of my Strictly experience was everything I could have dreamed of. The entire production team and everyone behind the scenes as well as my fellow contestants were so amazing to work with. However, my experience inside the training room was very different. Reports have been made about my treatment on the show and there were witnesses to some events, as well as videos of particular incidents which are incredibly distressing to watch. D. Prima told the male his reputation was zero, but he was determined to dance again. To view this video please enable JavaScript and consider upgrading to a web browser that supports HTML5 video. Right now, my reputation is zero and it will take a superhuman effort for me to get up from this hole, he said. But I do believe the truth always wins in the end. I am determined not to let my and my family's lives be destroyed. I will dance again. I will bring joy to people again with my dancing because this is who I am, an international professional dancer, a man of integrity, a loving husband and son who has never forgotten where he's come from. I will not let these lies define me. They are not who I am. Last month, it was claimed D. Prima was under medical supervision after allegations about his teaching methods emerged. His family members told The Mirror, Graziano is currently under medical supervision, with the stress of the situation causing significant concern for his family, who are monitoring him hourly. The unrelenting feeding frenzy over these accusations and his mental state leaves him at this time unable to defend himself. He is said to have flown out to Italy to be with his family staying on their remote farmhouse surrounded by vineyards away from the public eye. Two Strictly stars spotted going for training before they've been announced. BBC demands who Edwards repay nearly.